Hey, welcome back, one of most amazing top tenors. I'm Landon. This is a channel where we take interesting and crazy topics from all around the world and we compile them into a top 10 list for you guys' entertainment. Today, we're venturing off into space and I'm gonna be giving you guys the top 10 things found in outer space. So starting off this list, like we always do, at number 10, scientists have discovered a giant river of raspberry flavored rum. Well, not exactly. The Sagittarius B2 is a giant molecular cloud of gas and dust that is located near the Milky Way. This cloud contains ethanol, vinyl, alcohol, and methanol. These molecules from ethanol formate, which is a chemical that is said to smell like rum, and it is also the same chemical that gives raspberries their flavor. Alcohol is an organic compound, so if scientists could learn more about how these clouds manage to form in space, they might be able to figure out how life formed. Moving further up this list, at number 9, we have a water reservoir. Astronomers have discovered the largest and furthest reservoir of water ever detected in the universe. The water is equivalent to 140 trillion times of the water in the world's ocean, and it surrounds a huge black hole more than 12 billion light years away. The water reservoir is said to be 100,000 times more massive than the sun. Also making it onto this list at number 8, we're talking about the diamond planet. There is a research that suggests that a massive planet is made out of a large part of diamonds. Planet 55 Cancri E is twice the size of Earth, and it is rich in carbon that holds at least three times our planet's mass in diamonds. On 55 Cancri E, the surface is covered in graphite with diamonds diamonds push it through the layers from underneath. I mean, wow, can you guys imagine how much this planet would be worth here on Earth? The Pillars of Creation makes it onto this list at number 7. This was a photograph that was taken by Humble Space Telescope of interstellar gas and dust in Eagle Nubella, about 7,000 light years away from Earth. This photograph reveals the star forming process. So basically, the red coloring reveals ionized sulfur, the blue shows double ionized oxygen, and the green highlights hydrogen. So these pillars are basically seeds of new stars, which is pretty cool if you ask me. Making your way to number six, let's talk about the freezing star. While most of the known stars are very hot, there has been a cold star discovered quite recently. It was formerly known as Y0855-0714. The freezing star is a brown dwarf featuring temperatures between negative 55 to 8 Fahrenheit, which is about negative 48 to negative 13 degrees Celsius. Coming into number five, we have the star that is 1500 times bigger than our sun. This star is VY Canis Majoris. It is a red hypergiant roughly 1.7 billion miles in diameter, which means that it is so big that it takes about 8 hours for its own light to travel from one side to the other. It is located 4,900 light years away, so scientists haven't actually had the chance to study the stars properly. Make a wish because at number 4 we have shooting stars. I think I just saw one. So just to recap, everyone should know that shooting stars are meteors entering the atmosphere. Well, what some people don't know is that real shooting stars exist, but they are called hypervelocity stars. These are big fiery balls of gas rocketing through space at millions of miles per hour. So when a binary star system enters a black hole at the center of the galaxy, one of the two stars is consumed, while the other is ejected at high speed. Imagine this, a huge ball of gas four times the size of our sun and jolting out from our galaxy at a million miles an hour. Beware, because at number three we have the planet from hell. Seriously, the planet Gliese 581c wants to kill you. I'm actually not kidding. This planet orbits a red dwarf star, which is smaller than our sun, with a luminosity of only 1.3% of our sun. This means the planet is closer to its star than we are to ours. Because of this, one side of the planet is always facing the star, and the other side is always facing away. The position of this planet results in some pretty odd things. So if you were to step onto the star side of the planet, you would immediately melt your face. Whereas if you sit on the opposite side, you would freeze instantly. We're almost at the top of this list, but coming in at number two spot, we have this universe's largest electrical current. Though only just a few years ago, scientists stumbled upon electrical current that is roughly one trillion lightning bolts. The lightning is thought to originate from an enormous black hole in the center of the galaxy. Apparently the black hole's huge magnetic field allows it to fire up this lightning bolt through gas and dust to a distance of over 150,000 light years away. Okay, so we're now at the number one spot and we're talking about black holes. A black hole is a place in space where gravity pulls so much that even light can't escape. The gravity is so strong because matter has been squeezed into such a tiny space. This can also happen when a star is dying. 
because light cannot get out. People are unable to see black holes. They're actually invisible. However, there are certain space telescopes that are designed to help find black holes. Black holes still remain a mystery because scientists are unable to examine the interior of a black hole. We do know for certain to stay away from the event horizon, which is the border of the black hole. It's referred to as the point of no return. Well, there you guys have it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. It means the world to me and the universe. And I'll see you guys all in the next most amazing top 10 video. Thank <laughs> you.